In this video, we are going to talk about a new AI model that will give us this ability to generate high quality, realistic videos from our prompt or from our reference images. So if you're ready, let's begin. So this AI model that we're going to talk about is from Luma and it is called Ray Tree. So here is Ray Tree. I will put the link down in the description. Uh, the physics, it's really good. The look of it, uh, generating realistic videos. Uh, I really liked it. Uh, there are also some, of course, there are some weaknesses in it, but overall, comparing to what we had till now, it's fascinating what you can create with it. So at the end of the day, it comes down to trying and converting your imaginations into real life without any limits. So before, five years ago, 10 years ago, if you wanted to create something like this, you have been limited, right? You couldn't just write a text and get your video in five or 10 minutes. You had to spend hours, days, months with a team on it to get something with this quality. So this model, this version, it's much stronger uh, comparing to the previous models. And as I said, the physics, as you can see, the rain is coming, water hitting their body. And while they're fighting, all the splashes, it's really realistic. It's really doing a good job. And uh, there are a couple of things that I like really about this AI model. One of them is annotation. So you can draw your instructions, your prompt somehow on the image that you're providing the reference image. And then it will follow that. To show you more examples, here are some examples. There's a UFO here, this cow floating upward. And this is the result that they got. Or here we have a cat and the guy just drew the movement, the pattern of the movement, the flow of the movement, the direction of it using the annotation. And it's very easy to use. I will show it to you in a moment how you can use it. And the other thing is the draft mode that I really liked about this model. So before you generate the high quality, the final version result, you can create a draft mode, which it will be much cheaper for you. It will be ready much faster. In a couple of seconds, you will get the result. And also you can use it for free. So if you want to practice, if you want to test this AI model, you can use the draft mode for generating many different videos, test it. If you liked it, you jump on the paid plans. So the other thing that this AI model is good at it is the HDR lights. So just to show you an example, this is SDR and this is HDR. You see the difference of the colors, the quality, um, right? The colors, changes a lot and you can create something more alive out of it. So let's talk about how you can use it. All you need to do is to come here, click on try now. If you don't have an account, create an account, then it will jump on this page where you have your boards. You have ideas here. Uh, you can come to editor and edit your, um, edit your content in a moment. I will show you. So here is your account and um, here you can see the number of credits that you have. If uh, you have used them all like me, you have to buy more credits. And for example, you can get 2000 credits for $8 and so on. And here it mentioned how many videos. I think it, these are five second videos. Uh, it has shown how many five second videos you can generate. So for like something like $12, you can generate 45 videos around with the duration of five seconds, right? So to generate an image, uh, to generate a video, come to boards, click on this plus sign, and then write your prompt. For example, let me just test it here for you. Um, cat jumping on a tree in daylight. Okay, 
it's a very simple prompt. Um, if you are on free plan, it will be on draft mode. Then you can change the settings from here. You can click on describe and then videos. You can also generate images, but now we are testing because we want to uh, use Ray 3. We are on videos. You can select your aspect ratio and either if you want it to be on draft mode or higher quality, but notice that higher qualities are only for paid plans. Select Ray 3 from here and then you can have one or two versions so you can select out of it and here you can increase the duration up to 10 seconds but for now they don't have longer and then here you can select SDR or HDR which for my account because HDR is on paid plan but on the second paid plan which costs something around $30 per month I'm on the $10 per month so uh, if you jump on that payment plan you will also have access to HDR so when you're ready, just click on this arrow. I'm not sure if with my credit, it will generate. Oh, so I'm out of credit. So with that amount of credit, I cannot generate a video. But anyway, uh, if you are on free, uh, if you just create a new account, it will generate a couple of videos for you. It's really good to test. And here I can show you some examples. Let's come to boards. And here are some previous uh, projects that I created. And in a moment, I will show you the result. Uh, I, I'm sure you're going to like it. So, for example, this is a prompt that I wrote. A black panther is sleeping on a tree in daylight with blurred background and camera moving up slowly. And this is the result that I got. Uh, when you are on draft mode on free version, you get the Luma tag here and the quality is not very high. If I make it full screen, you can see the quality. It's dropping around the trees, right? But the general result, it's amazing. And you can keep continuing. You can talk about your next scenes or other prompts. You can add them here one by one. You can come here, click on show more. It will regenerate uh, another example with your prompt for you. And in case if you want to use annotation, all you have to do is to just drag and drop your image here as the starting frame. And then come here, click on this uh, draw icon. And when you are here, you can, if you are on brush, you can just draw the pattern that you want or draw an arrow, for example or even add some text Move to this direction. More or less, you are just adding your prompt on the image. And when you're done, click on done, and then it will get this image as the reference image and it will create your video based on this reference image, which is really amazing. Now, I wanna show you the result of me testing this model Ray 3. So I have used it to generate a couple of videos with the same prompt on free mode, on the draft mode, and also on the paid plan. So um, if I want to show you the boards, if I come here, um, here are seven ideas. I generated seven videos on the free mode and I generated eight videos on uh, paid mode, right? And I put these videos one after another, one after each other. So you can see more or less a story of a black panther spending its time in the jungle in a couple of shots, right? So let's see the results. So um, this is the uh, draft mode, the low quality, and let's look at it.
All right, so this was the draft node, and when I tested it, most of the scenes were was uh, created easily. Only I found some weaknesses in this shot. You see the butterfly movements uh, and the movements of the panther. Um, it's not 100% perfect, but still it's amazing. Maybe you get to uh, generate a couple of times for this scene, for scenes like this, until you get the result that you want. Maybe tweaking your prompt a couple of times. So now let's look at the result of the paid version. You see the movements of the uh, trees, the leaves are really good. The quality, the breathing of the panther, even the small muscles, it's really clear. The splash of the water, I really liked it. The quality is amazing. Again, we had the same challenge for the butterfly scene but still I was happy with it. I just tried it two times and I get the result that was more or less good. And here, this was the perfect scene that I really liked it. All the little furs, uh, the details. Let's look at it again. Let's look at the eye, the movements, the looking, the wind blowing in the uh, hairs, right? It's really amazing. And as I said, um, using this AI model, it's just your limit will be your imagination, right? You can create anything with it. You can create a short movie with it. All you need to do is to get some credits, play with it, write your prompts, think about the story and generate a short, maybe two or five minute video, right? That would be amazing. And also there's another part on Luma, uh, which is called editor. You can come here and you can upload your video. Let me bring one of the videos here. We're going to bring this one that I really liked. And then uh, you can modify it. You can generate audio for it. You can upscale it. Uh, you can reframe it. You can extend the video. Okay, I want to see the next five seconds of this video. You can do all that here after it is uploaded. It's uploading. Then all of these buttons will be available. And then you will modify your videos and get the result that you want so more or less that was all about ray 3 and how to use it i look forward to see your work and your videos and if you have any questions you can write it down in the comments if there is any specific ai model that you want me to talk about or teach it or make some examples go through with it you can write it down in the comments and i look forward to see you soon on another video